I'll close by uh, touting the Empathy Effect, a book by Helen Reese, the noted um, empathy researcher and psychiatrist uh, uh, at, uh, in the Harvard system, who said, you know, remember that empathy, this ability to understand what people are experiencing, is different in medicine than just empathy in uh, social circles. Because while empathy always means understanding what the other person is going through in medicine, we have the obligation to communicate this back to the patient. It doesn't do any good if it's all in our head. They have to know that we understand them. And we have to have that from our, our, our core value of compassion. That's why we went into medicine to begin with. And 80% of our uh, empathic communications are nonverbal. This mnemonic, uh, which she puts in her uh, book, which tells us that within a glance, we can see their eyes, the muscles of their face, look at the posture, uh, understand if they're sad or uh, joyous, label their affect, um, we hear their voice, um, and really label them as a person as opposed to a, a, a diagnosis. And finally, this is a work in progress, but you know, as a practitioner, generating your response to this. Um, is a master craft. And that uh, when we teach this in the medical school, I often hear, oh, we've had that in communications. And I am here to say that this is the process of lifelong learning. And if we're not always trying to make a better version of ourselves every day, uh, we will lose our way um, in this uh, uh, dual-targeted or person-centered care. So I hope this has been helpful. Thank you.